Hello, everybody. Hello. Welcome. Chrono Cross, baby. Today, my favorite RPG of all time. To end 2019, the end of a decade. I'm here. God, I'm so excited to play this game. Even though last time I played this was over a year ago. This will be probably my playthrough number 10. <laughs> 15. I lost count a long time ago. Welcome, everybody. Chrono Cross. Thanks for joining, guys. And of course, Happy New Year. Just waiting for more people to join. What's up, guys? Thanks for joining. Welcome. This is Chrono Cross, my absolute favorite RPG of all time. My favorite video game. The game that defined my life, the game that is responsible for me being here. Me and my channel probably wouldn't exist if it wasn't for this masterpiece of a game. So Happy New Year, everybody. And that's Harley, my favorite video game character. I love her. And I love her weird ass French accent. <laughs> I love that. I can't wait anymore, guys. I can't freaking wait anymore. Let's do this. Love that title screen and that title music. New game, vibration obviously on. This game, you can't choose the difficulty. Change the name, nope, Sergi. Happy New Year, everybody. Chrono Cross, the best game ever made, in my opinion. <laughs> Thanks for joining, everybody. Oh man, I can feel the controller vibrating in my hands. Thanks, Jeff. He says, just passing by, Happy New Year. Likewise, buddy. Thanks for joining and thanks for donating. Ugh. Love this game. The beginning. If you haven't played this game, what the hell are you doing here? Battle theme? Start. This is it. There is no turning back now. So this is a flashback or more like a flash forward of what happens afterwards. And then we're gonna go back like, I don't know, like months before this or weeks. This is how the game starts. And nope, this game never came out on the UK. That's so bad. Only Japan and only North America. Thanks, Rem. Wish I could go watch now, but I will definitely come back and watch this later. Well, you're welcome to do that. Thank you very much, Rem, for, your, for all your support. And Happy New Year. So obviously, the only scripted characters are Sergi and Kid here. Kid is this girl right here. And the third character is always like random. Every time you start a new playthrough, you're going to get a new character, a different one. Totally random. All right, let's go.
A Chrono Cross remake? Nah, maybe a remaster, you know, but nah, I think this game is perfect as it is. I don't want to fight that guy, no. <laughs> Here comes a guy I'm gonna have to find. No, it's not there, that's great. Chrono Cross. Yeah, the experience system, I'm gonna have to agree with everybody. The game's not perfect, but it's near damn perfect, man. Yeah, you don't level up unless you beat a boss. You can't level up or gain experience by defeating monsters. Sometimes you get HP status, but that's all. That's okay, though. God, I love this game. I'm getting a very serious nostalgia shot right here, right now. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I kind of memorized what you need to do in the um, later part in the game when you actually do this dungeon. I've forgotten you gotta go upstairs first. Because you go up there af after defeating the bosses that, that are blocking the crystals. And that, that crystal that I just deactivated? Yeah. You got, you're, you're supposed to fight a boss there. Anyway, here we are. Yeah, you guys in the UK missed a lot of great games, man. And this, there's no more perfect example than this. Can't believe this game was never released in Europe. I mean, you can play it nowadays with an emulator. It's probably re-released on the PSN too. My favorite part of the game involves a heavy spoiler, so I won't, I won't say it right now. What are we doing out here? She has sort of like an um, Irish accent, I reckon, or a farmer accent. Whoa, bugger, we're so high up. Is this thing floating? <laughs> Valkyrie Profile is not only a good game, it's a great game, it's another masterpiece. It sure is some fort. Eh, Sergi? I wonder how this game with voice acting will be, will turn out. I always imagine that. I like to fantasize with some voice actors. Who will be the voice, of, the voice of Kid? It'll be, it'll have to be someone with a very good Irish or some kind of weird ass accent. <laughs> All right, let's go. Epic beginning of the game. Open up, abracadabra. I do have a copy of Suikoden 2. Sent to me by a friend, a fan. Epic introduction. It just makes you wonder, you know, you're just playing with these guys, he has a knife, and then Kid's down there, and he smiles, Ah, oh, it hooks you, man, like, you wanna know what the hell is going on here. It's great. Great beginning. Sergi.
Good morning, Sergi. Come on, sleepyhead, get up! There's no music at this part of the game. Oh, there we go. There we go, we, we, we went back in time. Surge, Surge, Sergi, whatever. That's mom for you, Marge. Good morning, Surge. You're finally up. The sun's already reached high noon. By the way, didn't you have plans to meet with Lena this morning? You know, Lena, you remember Chrono Trigger yesterday, right? Queen Lini, and there's a character here called Lena. It's just a coincidence, though. They have nothing to do with each other. Girls can be pretty scary if you make them angry. Couldn't be far from the truth. Okay, so this kind of sucks. I can't use the joystick to move around. I gotta use the D-pad. The Why? That's, that's kind of bad, but okay. That's okay. Okay, you gotta go with... Um, Gotta recruit Poshul here. Yeah, I need a bone for Poshul so he can join me. Ah, uh, I don't know where to find it though. I don't remember. Anyway, let's just go with meet Lena. Ah, oh, where is it? Come on! Nope. Yeah, Serge, he's afraid of cats because of a panther demon. It left an emotional scar. This game left me an emotional scar, which is why I love it so much, maybe. Yeah, oh no, I triggered the dialogue again. You're late, Serge. Sleeping in as usual, I suppose. You promised you'd go get some Commodore Dragon scales for my necklace, remember? Since you were late, my mom asked me to babysit the kids. I'm about to start the first mission of the game, and yeah, it's uh, one of those missions that are not really that fun. I imagine it turned a lot of people off. You gotta chase some monsters, you know, and trap them. Komodo. But the most important thing now is not our childhood, but my Komodo scale necklace. <laughs> yes! We have to face up to reality and live each day anew. <laughs> right. I want you to go to Lizard Rock and get some scales for me. I will join you, but I still have to watch the kids. It's your fault, you were late. 
I was late because I was, I was you know, reminiscing in, in my dreams about Keith and Greco and... Yeah. Sure, no problem. Some of your decisions really matter in this game, you know, guys? This is a true role-playing game. Half of your choices in this game affect the story, the ending, the characters, everything. Three should be enough. I always loved Lena. She's so pretty. Long, straight red hair. And I always wonder why this girl right here is not a playable character. She has a portrait. Una. Yo, Sergi. I heard you totally blew off Lena this morning. I didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> I was really gutsy of you. <laughs> She's not her real sister, of course. Now we go to this part and I'm, try I'm gonna try to recruit Poshul. If you talk to Radius, you're gonna get a tutorial on how to play the game. I don't need that one, so let's just go. Me, I'm a bit busy right now, maybe next time. So you gotta find something for him, I don't remember what. Did you give Poshul a bone? I don't remember where to find the bone. Jesus, and I thought I had this game memorized, God damn it. That's my house, and over there is Poshul's house. Elements. Everything is about the elements. Show me your weapons armor. Sure, just one second. Yeah, you gotta... I'm gonna turn up the music, guys. Just love the music a lot in this game. There we go, a little bit, just a little bit. You can buy all of this. I only have 100 though. There we go. I'll need that for the boss. Okay. How many times have I played through this game? Probably more than 10. And I've gotten every single ending. Oh, there we go. Thanks, Aaron. Find the Hecran bone under the bed in the room above the restaurant. Thanks, buddy. Oh, there's Nikki in a portrait. <laughs> Do you want to hear the real truth about the world? No! Now I'm stuck with the story. A lone crimson tear falls to the Z. The echo of the remaining star cries out in the infinite vacuum. All right. No, this game is not easy, dude. This game is hard. It's not that hard, but it is hard. Oh, come on, the waitress, she just won't shut up. Oh, come on. 
So this is the bed, right? Heck, Crambone. All right, let's take that back to Poshul and recruit the dog. Well, it isn't hard. It isn't that hard if you know what you're doing. My first playthrough was a nightmare. I had to rely on a guide. And guides back then, this was, I'm talking about 14 years ago, man. Guides back then weren't what they are right now. Yeah, I struggled with this game, but it was worth it. Every single minute I put into this game was totally fucking worth it. Ah, is that the Hecram Bone? Sergi Serge Poo, a present for I? A present. How do you know? Hmm, to accept or not to accept? Just accept, goddammit, and join me. She's gonna accept my present. Me will do anything you want. Well, too bad it's just a dog. Nope, I'll skip the tutorial, guys. It's pretty damn long and boring, so no. All right, got myself a party member. Let's go. Totally worth it, this game. Masterpiece, god damn it. Let's open the menu, save the game. Okay, we're good to go. All right, the first battle. No, you could have. I could have like um, two thousand people. <laughs> 70 isn't max, it's just people keep leaving and joining and leaving and the usual. So the battle flow gets interrupted every now and then. And you could just do this. Die already. Yeah. <laughs> I'm on a roll here. Come on. <laughs> this is how you abuse the battle system. <laughs> there we go. You see? Perfect battle. No damage. Sergi HP plus one. This is what I was talking about. You don't gain experience, but it's like the saga games, you know, like. Uh, the Saga Frontier, Romancing Saga, you don't exactly level up unless you beat a boss. And in normal battles give you these kind of power-ups sets, sets up there. I got a plus HP, so that's cool. Max healing without using consumables. And I got a cure. Well, use the cure. Fireball. Put fireball on Poshul. 
we can have um, so I need to trap these dragons there's a trick to that of course All right, Poshul. And he did take damage last time, right? That's your heat percentage. Yes, I've played Onimusha Tactics on the Game Boy Advance. Pretty good game. It is a hidden gem. I agree. Okay. Don't respond yet. Didn't respond. That's the guy you gotta outrun. Here we are again. Oh yeah, you gotta sur surprise this guy. He's gonna go there. Yeah. Now we move this. So now he'll be trapped. Yeah, you gotta trap these guys and then fight them. And then once you fight all three, you get the, the boss fight. Yeah, it's all coming back to me how to trap these damn lizards. No, I haven't, I haven't played all of the Atelier games. I've played most of them, but not all of them. Oh, I respawn. Oh. Got to reset. There we go. I thought you had to come back from the other side, you know, otherwise he was going to run away off screen i guess it didn't do that
There we go. These guys are water elemental, all of them. So water doesn't do much damage, but you know, it delivers. They have like 30 HP or something. Yeah, something like that. Oh, you don't have to apologize, buddy. Everybody knows Chrono Cross is a much better game than Chrono Trigger. <laughs> right? Don't you dare argue, not today. Okay, got my first Comet scale. Now let's trap the other guys. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. To each their own, that's all right. They're both great games anyway. Okay, so... Gotta defeat this guy for that treasure chest. No, no remaster. I don't think it needs a remaster, but you know, it'll be pretty awesome anyway, if you got, if you got one. There we go. Got him. All right, got it. Yeah, this game has, I have to admit it, it, it has a little bit of a slow beginning. But I don't know, I always found it fun to chase after the Komodo dragons or Komodo or whatever. All right, what did I get? Another element, a tablet. That's gotta go for partial. Gonna make a fireball plus two. It'll do more damage, obviously. You gotta outrun this guy, it's really hard. Oh, I got stuck. Come on, come on, come on. This is really hard with a D-pad. Yeah, got him. It's a shame, it's a real shame I can't use the joystick, but whatever. Can't complain, it's Chrono Cross. Yeah, slow beginning, but not that slow. Other games have slower beginnings. This one's okay. Take that and burn to ashes. That's my partial. There we go.
plus one. All right, one more to go. So I went out, you know, because once I get the third guy, I'm gonna have to fight a boss. Just to make sure to save. Okay. Next guy is the trickiest. He's a pain in the ass because you gotta you gotta land right at, on top of him on this part. Silver loop. So I can have more hit percentage. So the dragon, he's gone. You gotta come from this side. So this is what you gotta do. You come back. Do I still use Twitch? I do, but it's like once per month. You know, it's just Twitch's business model doesn't work out for me. Just let the guy, we don't want to scare the guy. Okay. Ugh. I don't want to fight these guys, come on. Is this the best JRPG of all time? You bet your ass it is, just because I say so. No other reason. Because it's a masterpiece, everything is great. Oh, I gotta fight this guy. God damn it. So, yes, everything is excellent. The battle system, the music, the story, the characters. The graphics for its time. Everything. <laughs> Top 10 all time JRPG masterpieces. <laughs> Not a bad idea, but you know, it's gonna be full of my favorite games, so what's the point? I'll do a top 50 favorite JRPGs of all time one day. Top 50. Okay, I don't wanna fight these guys, so... Yeah. So you're here, you gotta wait for the guy, and then... You gotta fall on top of him, that's the only way. Okay. You gotta calculate. Come on, come on. There we go. Yeah! Got in my first try. Otherwise, you gotta have, have to do all over again. Just keep climbing and that's a pain in the ass. Oh! Hope, 
Hope you guys didn't hear that. Sorry about the noise, guys. Something happened upstairs. And that's the boss. They're fixing a few cabinets and... Twenty-two damage. Not bad. Okay, I'll be fine. I don't need the fireball. Yeah. Just need to get my healing spots ready if something happens. There we go. He's out of stamina, so that's not a good thing. Okay. It'll go down eventually, you know. It's, he's dying already. Eighteen damage, that wasn't so bad. Almost there. There we go. He's down. So poor Surge had to put his life on the line, face a gigantic lizard dragon, kill innocent monsters, all to get Lena a necklace. Hey Dan, I'm playing this on the PS3. I have the original copy on the PS1, playing it on the PS3. We now have the three Komodo scales. Red get moving to Opata Beach and wait for Lena. Yeah. Move. Move, sir. You're in the way. Come on, dude. I want to fight that guy. Come on. Yeah, he's going away. No, no. There we go. Yeah, it looks great. It's specifically because of the um, the Elgato HD capture card. That's why it looks so good. I mean, PS1 games look really good on the PS3, and now with the Elgato capture card, they look better, don't they? Yeah, I don't remember how to get that treasure chest. The one over there, but you know, that's okay. I don't really care. So this is it guys, the real beginning of the game. You are about to witness one of the greatest early, really early plot twists in the history of gaming. There you are. Well, you'll see the plot twist after, after a little bit of dialogue. 
I didn't expect to see you here, so this is where you went off to. Lineth here, how are you doing? Oh, are you two on a date? Saw we. Me think me she'll review to our own. <laughs> yeah. We want to know what happens. Push you? Well, you'll see what happens. No spoilers. Just watch. Can you play this one on PS4? Nope. Unless they re-release it digitally like they did on the PS3 and PSP, I think. Nope. This game's not on the PS4 store. That'll be awesome, though. Could use a remaster. Oh boy, that was fantastic. Every time I see that, it gives me the chills, man. Chills down my spine. I love that scene. It's the start, a plot twist, an early plot twist. I love it. I mean, this moment here, when I first played this game, you know, this moment was everything, you know, everything that I needed to be completely hooked. And I didn't play anything else for weeks. The second I finished the game, I, com I immediately restarted it to get another ending, another route, and so on. I think I did like three different playthroughs or four in a row.
Hey, Rath. Thanks for joining, man. Chrono freaking cross. <laughs> yeah. And there's Poshul. She came with me to another world, to another dimension. She's hard to read, but no sign of Lena anywhere. You think Lena temporary combusted? <laughs> Spontaneous, spontaneously combusted. <laughs> me wonder if she's okay. So you get your, you, you, you keep your party member. That's how awesome it is. See the music changed. Love that theme. I love it. No, then I've only played the demo of Trails of Cold Steel 3. So here we have like different monsters and shit. You can fight them, but they're they're kind of tough, tougher than before. Happy New Year, guys! Happy New Freaking Year! Cheers for 2020 of more awesome videos. There we go. Not that tough, hey? <laughs> no problem, Mountain. Take care. Happy New Year, buddy. Now I gotta get that treasure chest. <laughs> yes, yeah, till 2019 here. It's uh, six something, I, I guess. There we go. All gone in one turn. That surge for you. Surge, surgy, whatever. An ivory helmet. It's a piece of armor. Everything needs to be on surge. I mean, you, you still, I'm still gonna keep partial for a while. Kid's gonna join me. Oops, spoiler. You didn't hear anything. Oh, wait a minute. Let's just save the game. We, we're gonna get a scene here.
Cheers to 2020, everybody. Let's continue with this plot twist. I love this song. How could you just leave us and go back on your own? Go back on my own? What are you talking about, Poshul? And who are you? You jerk. <laughs> Don't be silly. Don't go swimming out of too far, you hear? Kids. I guess kids will be kids. <laughs> don't worry about them. You really don't know who I am, Lena? What was his name? What do you want to know his name? He died. You see, Serge is dead in this world, in this dimension. He's dead. Surge. I'm Surge. <laughs> she kind of liked him. <laughs> His grave, you know, it's gonna be disturbing to go up there and see your own grave. Goodbye, stranger. And why is this game so fucking epic? Let's go. Haha, <laughs> everybody went quiet on that. <laughs> now let's go back home to find out that this is not his house anymore. The room looks different. Mama Sergi, Serge, did you redecorate? It looks a little depressing. Looks like the this room redecorated too. I'm trying to translate this guy. It kind of looks like a junk room. And it's so dirty. What are you doing here, man? This is my island. <laughs> I'll re let you rest here for a while, man. So you want to rest, man? Yes, please. Have a good night, man. I love that character. <laughs> I 
100 men didn't they let you rescue her? Quit complaining, man. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Asshole. What are you doing in my house? Go play outside. Who are you, mister? This is Sergi's house, isn't it? Where is Mama Sergi? Or Serge? I'm used to calling him Sergi. Marge? Who the heck is that? Live in this house for five years now. I guess I'll get used to calling him Serge now. Serge. Sounds like searching. You know, like the verb. Whatever with all your gibberish, man. Just get out of here. <laughs> Chrono Cross, everybody. Hello, can I interest you in something? Yes, I'd like to take a look. Let's buy another fireball. Another one of these. can make an ivory dagger, I don't need it. It's for kid, you know. And this is completely useless. Well, that's all. Can't go in here or what? Surge. Yeah, there's a character here. You gotta go back and forth. Mojo or something. But I don't wanna bore you guys with side quests. So let's just continue on with the main quest. Please let me save first. What a great game, right guys? I mean, don't tell me you're not already hooked with this story like Surge in another dimension. He's dead. What the hell happened? And now he's gonna go look at his own grave? Bone, you need those to make weapons. Here we are, the grave, the moment of truth. It's just, you know, this is one of those games that connects with you in an emotional level like very deep that's why i love it so much no other game has been able to connect that much with me maybe valkyrie profile 2 but nowhere near as deep as this nowhere man r.i.p our beloved surge died at age seven nobody can take anything away from him nor can anyone give him anything to him. What came from the sea has returned to the sea. The ghost of the boy who died 10 years ago. 
Ah. Of course I'll pick Lick Kid. Kid's a much better character and... <laughs> what happened to Poshul? <laughs> he just fell off the cliff. Be a good boy and come with us. This is Karsh. This is Karsh and in my opinion he's one of the best characters in the game. Although right now he's, you know, one of the bad guys, an antagonist. He joins very late in the game. Oh, of course I'll stream Octopath Traveler once I get it. I don't have that game. We found the boy here, just as he said we would, didn't we? Now seize him! Hold your horses! <laughs> there she is! With the... Man, that smile, how can you say no to that? You care about Kid in this game. You really do. This game makes you really care about the characters. Shut your trap. You're the ones who'd better get out of the way. That's enough. Listen up, Junior. Our orders are to take you in. We don't want to hurt you, just come with us. Or else this axe of mine will have to do the talking. Will you just shut up and get on with it? I'm gonna kick your sorry arses so hard you'll kiss the moons. That is the legendary quote from Kid. Valkyrie profile, I don't have my copy here, otherwise I would have streamed it a long time ago. No Poshul for this battle, because, you know, these guys kicked him out of the cliff, or her. I think Poshul is a girl, right? A female dog. Sir, oh, this is a, sort of like a tutorial. It's, it's a very funny part. <laughs> How unfortunately unfortunate, I do not seem to have any, sir. You need come poop. <laughs> Shaking my shoes to tell you this, sir, but I don't have any either. Now to let you see the cars, show us how it's done. Useless fools. Real men don't need magic when they can fight with their might. Obviously the feel effect you, you guys see in, in the top corner, it heavily influences the, the outcome of the battle or the flow of battle. If it's one element, for example, if it was completely red and I choose an, a, a red element, it's gonna do massive damage, especially if the enemy's element is the opposite, which will be blue, like water. So I'm gonna try to do that. 
I'm pretty sure Karsh is gonna use something to change it all. There we go. Yeah. Come on, Karsh. It's just you, man. All red. He's gonna give, do like 20 something damage. 27. Wow, that, that's great. Nothing here, nothing here. Just healing items. Uh, let's just fight. Come on, Karsh. Is that your best? Yeah, that's all. Almost there. There we go. ECS Pie. Yeah, level up. Girl. <laughs> Come on, she's kid. She's not just girl, but I guess girl is as trivial as kid, huh? I say we shake it on out of here. <laughs> Damn cowards. Huh. As for you, Missy, we won't forget this. Ooh, I'm so scared. I'll be happy to take you on anytime. So this is one of the first decisions that affect the game. Comes. She's gonna try to join you, kid. And if you say no like two or three times in a row, she walks away, then you go back, recruit Lena, and then you meet kid later on Termina. And she joins you there. Your name's Serge, ain't it? So if you want both girls, like as in both love interests for Serge, for Serge, that's what you gotta do. You saw it first on Eric Landon RPG. Dario, that's not a recruitable character. Call me Kid. Nice to meet ya. I just couldn't stand by and watch those blows gang up on you like that. So she, yeah, she's like a British accent. Blogues? Come on, only British people use that word, blogues. They just pissed the bloody hell out of me. I wish I could have beat him up some more. But why was that mob after you? Yeah, I suck. Translating. My so-called ridiculous British accent. Hey, Serge. How about you and me team up for a while? Sure. She's new to these islands. Yeah, whatever. You're here looking for links. Perhaps it was fate that we will meet up like this. So refuse, so we can get Lena and Kid at the same time. Hang on. Are you telling me you're gonna refuse the company of a lonely, vulnerable, sweet little girl? Yes, as a matter of fact, I will. It doesn't affect the ending, you know. You sure that, mate? You might lead to regret it, you know. The game's just teasing. No thanks. And then she goes away. Have your way, mate. She's gone. Don't worry, if you do this, if you do exactly what I just did, it doesn't affect the ending or anything. She just goes on her own and then you meet her later. 
and she joins your party. Although it, the game's the game kind of makes you feel like shit for regret for rejecting her. <laughs> You'll be getting pretty dark soon. I suggest you go find a place to shack off for the night. Don't want you to become Hecram Bait now. Well, see ya. Okay. So where's Poshul? There you go. There she is. Chrono Cross, everybody. There you have it. That's Lena, and she's gonna join your party, Bobby. Rise and shine, everyone. A new day awaits. Surge, right? Kind of feels odd calling you that. Lena is not that good of a character in battle. But she's okay, though. She's slightly better than Poshul. So you get, to you get to play with Kid and Lena, both on your party, for a while. She has a frying pan, that's right. <laughs> you don't seem like such a bad person either. Come on, you're in love with me, just admit it. Let me join you. I feel like I've always known you. Sounds strange, doesn't it? You've always known me, Lena. <laughs> Lena joins your party. Okay, let's head to Termina. Full speed ahead, says Poshul. Okay. Keith and Lena in the party. Coming up soon. Yeah, she has nothing. That's kind of bad. I mean, there are better elements in Termina, of course, but we're gonna do some fighting ahead. Might as well, right? Okay. Indeed, man, to get Glenn in your party, it's harsh, but no spoilers, please. That's a big spoiler. No, it's not really worth it. Well, he is a very good character, but what you have to do in order to get that guy, it's not worth it, story-wise. Kind of breaks your heart. Yeah, let's just not talk about that. It's a major spoiler in the game. All right. Let's go to Termina. Our excavation is nearly complete. Just stick to the low path and make your way through. We still have some of our men working on the high ground, so do not interfere with their work. Yeah, whatever, man. Here they are once again, these two. Well, I wish there was a remaster for Chrono Cross, but to be honest, I don't really care because I think the game right now is 
This game has dated like very good. It's perfect. It could use a remaster, that's true, but I don't think it's necessary. The Legend of Dragoon is one, is one game that needs a remaster or a remake. Yeah, a remaster for Chrono Cross, sure. Why the hell not? Here we go again. That's a big bird up there. You don't want to mess with that unless you want to get another character. A very good character, as a matter of fact. You gotta collect all the bones and shit. This time, I made sure to bring a black element with me, Pepper. And they're gonna fuck it up all. Once again. Fuck it up, shake it up. Turn black. So now I'm black element. <laughs> wow, 90 people in the chat, guys. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Thanks for joining me on my favorite RPG of all time, playthrough. Oh, how awfully awful! I'm afraid I didn't, Pepper. Dumbass. Yeah, let's hope I can get 100 people watching. <laughs> Strengthen. Hard to get, hit that guy, you know, because he's lame and all. I guess an Aqua Beam plus one will suffice. Nine to five people watching. Come on, five more. <laughs> Five more and we'll get to 100. So this is Lena. Pepper box. That's gonna hurt. Oh, it wasn't too bad, was it? That should be enough to get rid of these bastards. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, I got an uplift. That's a nerf elemental attack. Retreat! Let's shake it on out of here. So yeah, like I said, you're, you're probably curious about that bird up there. It looks like a boss, and it is. But it's not a good idea to fight him now. Freaking music, man. It's excellent. Every single theme in this game is absolutely amazing. This is Yashinori Mitsuda's masterpiece. Alright, let's head to Termina and recruit Kid. That's Glenn. Young man, also known as Glenn. So this is the famous Glenn. Great character. Ha! 
Happy New Year, everybody, and thanks for joining Chrono Cross. My favorite RPG of all time. Yeah, I keep saying that, I know. I know. If you ever see him, give him my regards. <laughs> I will do that, and I will be back, too. I think he's gonna run. Yeah, go away, Glenn. That's Kid. God, you're slow. You made it wait forever, making a lovely lady like. Aha, so that's it. <laughs> it was all worth it to get this scene. I get it. This Sheila over here is your sweetie, eh? <laughs> I'm right, ain't I? No need to be shy. I'm not so bold as to break your lover's tender moments. <laughs> I'm understanding. I'll wait, I'll wait until your little date's over. Well then, have a bloody good time. <laughs> Lisa, another character with a portrait. Well, you don't get her either. Since when did you have a boyfriend? Lena's pretty. So is Lisa. Is my cousin. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, so she's your girlfriend. Hmm. <laughs> if you still want to go on a date, that's cool with me. Oh, Lisa, stop that nonsense. Typical. Nothing is more nostalgic than me than Chrono, to me than Chrono Cross. All right. She's red, right? Lena is a red element, right? No, she's blue. Better if we leave that aqua beam there. Yeah, it's better. Okay. Chrono Cross or Sweet Good and Two? Chrono Cross for me, buddy. All the way. When you first bought this game, where did you get it from? Uh, it was a flea market. I got a pirated copy, and I thought it was gonna be a, an adventure game for two players so I can play with my sister. And voila, quite a surprise, I went home, played the game, and fell in love with RPGs. Man, I can't believe Keith got so jealous. <laughs> Gets me every time. And my first physical original copy, I don't exactly remember where I got it. It's 
Depending on who you talk to in this part of the game, you get a different character. Preferably... You, me. Mickey and Mickey. I'm gonna go with Guile because he's the best character. So you gotta talk to all the people in this boat to learn that Nikki, the rock star and dancer, well, Mickey, the sister, is a dancer. And you learn that Nikki walked away and went to the Shadow Forest and if you wanna go to that route, then you go there. But no, I'm gonna go with Guile. How do you like the living voodoo, voodoo doll? Oh, Mojo, you mean Mojo. That's a pretty good character, as a matter of fact. Master Viper, I'm here to polish your statue again. All right, all squeaky clean. It's gotta be extra clean for coming festivities. And there, there's a third guy, I don't remember the name. He's a fancy guy, staying at an... At, 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 um, at this blacksmith's house, I remember, he's there, you gotta talk to him and then you fight a really hard boss battle at the entrance of Viper Manor. But he's a very lame character, you know. You wanna get Guile here. Yeah, that metal guy. What was his name again? Pierre, yeah. Pierre, he is one of the worst characters, that's right. He sucks. Come on, people, join, join. 97 watching now. We need three more to hit 100 and make this last day of 2019 more epic. Oh, this guy's a big fan of Viper Manor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, an upright citizen like myself might get invited to the Manor's garden party. But not so for you folks. <laughs> what a moron. And here she is again. She's gonna join for good now. All right, that's settled. We've gotta sneak into Viper Manor. We gotta find out what the Akasha Dragoons are up to, right? And why that car bloke was trying to capture you. 99 people, come on, one more. Oh, somebody left. Okay, let's go. It's the obvious choice, right? <laughs> The teleporter to exchange party members. <laughs> Finally, in my party. Let's take out Poshul. There we go. What sucks is that you have to go outside, put Poshul in the party, take out his elements. Haha, <laughs> there she is, the controversial lady. Reading Fortune. Who might you be? Fortunes be good, for fortunes be bad. Anything from reading your destiny to searching for the missing, do you wish your fortune be red? Yes. Kid, please. Let's see what happens. <laughs> you there. Both the look of a beauty and the look of a beast. Be mindful not to bring about your own end, my dear. She says the exact same thing to Harley once you get Harley later in the game, much later in the game. Sorry, mom, I don't believe fortune telling at all. Mom. Huh. Ha! 
I don't give a damn. Let's go search. It's free, so why the hell not? You're not dead or anything, are you? <laughs> yes, as a matter of fact, I'm dead. 100 people watching, everybody. Thank you very much. The last stream of 2019. Awesome to have you all here, guys, watching. Watching me play my favorite RPG of all time. Chrono fucking cross. I don't care about Lena, so yeah, let's just go. The prize of all prizes, huh? A rare catch, a live mermaid. Yeah, right. Thanks, Jason. Thank you very much. Well, don't worry, Chrono Cross is a much better game than Final Fantasy VII. In my opinion. My valuable, valuable, controversial, astonishingly great opinion. <laughs> I knew it was gonna trigger somebody. Korcha shows up. Hey you, you think this is really fun? How will Cha feel if you were trapped in a tank like that? Being stared at every day, huh? I mean, don't get me wrong, I love Final Fantasy VII. It's one of my favorite Final Fantasy games ever. But yeah, it's overrated. But God, the music in that game is so good. Best music in a Final Fantasy game. You're selling a bunch of ball. <laughs> Sword of Vermilion? <laughs> Get back to your demi-human friends! <laughs> I won't take that from a sleaze bag like you. Hey, you guys, you're not from around here, huh? Don't chat wander around too much or you're gonna be, get burned. Just watch your back. Korcha is kind of, you know, kind of a mediocre character. You do get this guy later in, in the game, but... Oh, and he, he falls in love with Kid. <laughs> Has a crush on her. All right, now we gotta get that scene with Greco, and then we'll be set. If you have no business here, leave now. Fuck you, old lady. I ain't leaving. Greco first. Oh, he's not here. He'll be back. Now let's watch this scene with Glenn and Riddell. Sad scene. Father, brother. It is such a mystery. This sword never rusts, even when left in the rain. There's no music in this moment. Oh, there, there you have it. It's barely there. The Ain Lancer. Ain Lancer, I mean. 
the Ein Lanzer. That's how it's pronounced. Miss Riddell, I cannot allow even you to. Do you not think there is something odd about the Dragoons of late? <laughs> I gotta say, I really like this theme. Just this game is full of melancholy. Yeah, you're right, there were some fan theories in the past about Glenn being frog. But nothing was ever proven, it was just a fan theory. Oh, it's you guys, you're tourists, right? Festival's a waste of time. <laughs> that's, why, that's what I say to everyone who comes to Mexico for festivals and shit. Festival's a waste of time. I take money, but don't worry, it's not that much. <laughs> but then he's gonna take a look at Kid and... As long as you can pay me, I'll take you anywhere you want. It's just that I don't know how to get to the manor. You need to bring someone who does. So you can just keep this guy and go straight for Nikki to the Shadow Forest. Guile, which knows how to get into the back of the manor. Or Pierre, who just goes straight up front to the front door to a really hard boss battle. And since he's a really bad character, I don't want to do that. I always go with Guile. I mean, I've done the other two, but... Jesus Christ, can't believe these guys are still working upstairs. Let me just buy a couple of things. I, I'm too lazy to go outside and take him off from Poshul. Just one green. Go with that one. So this is where Guile is in the bar.
Oh, I knew it. I need to take out Lina from the party and put Guile in it. That sucks. I really wanted to keep Lina so I can see Kid and Lina fighting side by side in battle. That's okay though. You know what's funny about Lina is that she never speaks again. <laughs> I think there's like one or two scenes involving a really small dialogue, but nope, she doesn't speak again. All right, back at this place. So first of all, let's take everything from Lena. Remove all. Used the teleporter, switch Lena for Guile. His innate color is black, it's black elemental guy. And, and you allocate everything to this guy. And it's, it's better. Sure. Sucks because Lina has more spaces. But you know what? That's okay. This is my higher viewers count ever. 113 people watching. Thanks, guys. Thanks for joining. about to head out to Viper Manor. It's a fun mission. It's kind of tedious in some areas, but it's a fun mission. It's memorable, to say the least. Yeah, 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 the same dialogue again. I shall guide you there. Are you sure you can get into a place like that? Yes, trust me, all you need to do is prepare the boat. Tough boss coming up ahead. 100 gold, Jesus. Oh, you can grind in this game. As a matter of fact, there's a couple of areas when, where you kind of need to grind, not for experience, but at least to boost your HP or to get items or money, etc. Get better elements. Yeah, there is grinding in this game, but it's not exactly a grindy RPG. Don't you worry about a thing. Let's go to the manor and no, for the record, Korcha doesn't join your party for this mission. Joins after the mission. Well, depends on your choices, right? Like I said, it's all a matter of choices, this game. Your decisions matter. A lot. I mean, you saw what happened. I rejected Kid at the beginning. It changed nothing, but I got Lina. You can't get Lina unless you reject Kid at the beginning, which is pretty interesting. I mean, there's no way to know that unless you read a walkthrough or just out of curiosity, you just reject Kid to see what happens. And that's what happens. Yeah, let's just agree with the fact that grinding is entirely optional. It's not really required. Don't you think it's pretty dangerous? Indeed. 
will make it. <laughs> Sound confident. All right, let's get our arses in gear. Arses. <laughs> our arses. I like to grind too, depending on the games. So in some games, I just don't like them. Oh, intruders! Yeah, you see Guile? You moron. Yeah. A tablet. There we go. <laughs> a magma bomb. It's a good choice, you know, to damage all enemies. Because these guys are kind of wacky. I mean, I don't even know who the hell I'm fighting. I wonder what kind of creature dwells inside of those cocoons. Dead. All right, Guile, your turn. Yeah. Wow, Kid got an HP plus three. Now she has more HP than Surge. That's interesting. That's cool, the more HP points you get, the better. You gotta fight these guys. Well, at least the rock didn't hit me, which is good as a matter of fact. <laughs> it's a good thing. Oh, they started. Wow. Guile's gonna have to heal himself. Aha, <laughs> dead. All of them. What are you talking about, guys? I can't beat this game tonight. It's a 40 hour game. I got a magma bomb. That's cool. Oh, the fucking rock still tossed me over. Still with only two spaces. That's kind of bad. Let's 
just wait, just wait, just wait. There. Ah, oh, god damn it. Bound to happen. Well, it kind of needed to happen, you know. Okay, so here comes the boss. Better safe than sorry, right? Kit's all right, she'll make it. You know, never mind. Just better safe than sorry. Right, let's do this. Oh, they made it up! Ah! Ha ha ha! this guy. He's not, he's not the boss. There's another boss coming up. After these guys. Yeah, Nikki is a pretty good character. It's not among the best for on the game, but for this part of the game, he is pretty good. These guys are yellow, so green elements are gonna hurt them more. Yeah, 58, wow, Christ. <laughs> That's awesome. Level up. Have some of this. Oops. <laughs> More. He's gonna bring the real boss. Yep. Tough boss. This guy's tough. And no, you can't just go outside and heal. You can do this. You have more spaces now. You gotta take advantage of that. Oh, come on, Guile. Really? Really, Guile? Oh, man, this guy. That's okay, though. Let's just do this. do nimble oh I didn't see that come on now Sergi set of stamina not a good thing this guy's red so That's okay. Wow, still alive, huh? Now we're all red. Oh, come on. Jesus! Can't believe these guys! Yeah, attacking with a red element against a red element girl. Not gonna do much damage.
Time to heal. Just die already. Oh man, still alive. Twin turbo, huh? Jesus, that's not good. Fuck! Fuck! And now he's dead. I can't believe they fucking did that, you know? My health was full. That was so fucking cheap. So fucking cheap. Forty-three damage, Jesus. Yeah, I gotta change the element, otherwise he's gonna do another black attack and it's gonna kick my ass. Well, if things go sideways, you can run away from bosses, you know. Almost dead. Yeah. Well, Surge is not gonna get any experience, but whatever. I don't mind. It's just a stream.
gonna do this and then the eyes lands all the way here. And then for gravity blow. Because we'll get rid of the fireball and then magma bomb plus three. And for Guile, well, he can have um, a fireball. And you know what? Our, uh, yeah, our saucer plus. Yep. That's okay. So Keith has a status effect of burn. Ah. You gotta go with this guy and play sort of like a mini game or something. He's still following me. <laughs> Ointment. That's what I need, I think. That's what I need. Yes. To cure burn. Yeah, I just want to fight the guy, you know, to use cure and heal on my allies. I don't have any tablets anyway. Should have brought a lot of with me. I should have bought more tablets, obviously. A remake of Chrono Cross. Yeah, it's okay. I will settle for a remaster, but that's just my opinion. Magma Bomb plus two. <laughs> that's gonna hurt. Yes, it did. Poor Surge, now he has 88 HP, and the others have like way more, like 20 more. That's sad, man. Yeah, that's right, it's a while until you finally get to save. Yeah, finally got some tablets. I got a photon ray. Let's ditch the fireball.
Yeah, 100 damage. <laughs> really powerful attack. All right, more tablets. So this is why you kind of grind in the game. It's locked. Bloody hell, I knew it was locked. Search, let's, let's check out the back. You gotta avoid the lights. Or well, you can just fight everybody for tablets and farm tablets, of course. Here we are at the stables. Finally, you can save your precious game. Oh yeah, and now for the mini game. <laughs> this fucking mini game. Uh... <laughs> Do you have a key to the manor? Sure do, wouldn't mind giving it to you if you take on this job. Do it, Sergi. All right. All you have to do is feed the dragons and satisfy their hunger. I don't need your reward. I don't give a shit. A knee pad. And you can do this as many times as possible and you get, until you get 50 times and for a bigger reward. And there's a manor key. Save again, yes, once again. Wow, it's been over two hours. I can't believe it. The <laughs> time sure flies with my favorite game of all time. <laughs> it's just that good. That good of a game, guys. Oof. That guy just walked right past through me. How do I get this treasure chest? I don't remember. Oh, let's just fight them all. You know, more tablets, right? And you're gonna need tablets in this game. I think I can fetch a copy of the Legend of Dragoon. I might stream it soon. Legend of Legaia 2, Wild Arms, and a bunch of PS2 games. Now that I have a cable to stream on the PS2, a cable to with an HDMI cable. A PS2 with an HDMI cable. I connect that cable to the Elgato capture card and I can stream some, I don't know, Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne, maybe? How about Valkyrie Profile or, you know, Grow Lancer? But the only Grow Lancer 5 copy that I have here is sealed. And I kind of don't want to open it. Oh. oh, 
Oh, come on, man, die. Shin Megami, you guys want Shin, Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne, huh? <laughs> How about Xeno Saga? I have the three games here. Have a lot of games, man. It's gonna be a, a good year full of great streams. So best best thing you want to do in this game is kill everybody, every single monster or enemy in this game, so you get a lot of HP. That really helps in some tough battles, so you don't have to die like I just did with that fucking bird. Wow, that guy evaded all my attacks. <laughs> Wow, what an asshole. Parasite Eve, I already streamed that one and finished it. Not live though, but I, maybe I could finish it one day live, do a full playthrough. It's a pretty short game. It's not even 10 hours. Wish I could stream 3DS games. It's not gonna be possible. I try streaming Nintendo DS games once and it didn't work out, my laptop lacks. I need a better laptop. What country am I from? Mexico. Hey, that's an interesting question. What was the last JRPG you beat in 2019? Uh, for me, it was I Am Setsuna. My favorite character in Chrono Cross is Harley. Harley, I love her. Have a crush on her. Yeah, I beat I Am Setsuna when was this, like a week ago? And then I got back to God Wars and it's kicking my ass. He managed to put a fucking sword strike on me. No problem, always, never. Happy New Year to you too. Happy New Year to everybody. Wow, I got a bust of status, you know, it's like I leveled up. HP, resistance, magic. See what I mean? <laughs> you need to play this game, guys. Of course I'm in heaven. How do you keep up with so many JRPGs? Do you skip those that you feel like are not immersing you in? Yeah, that is correct. That's exactly what I do, I think. Oh man, I fell right into the trap. God damn it. Well, I got four guys, so maybe I'll get a better reward. Well, to answer your question, I made a video. Uh, it's called, where do you find the time to play all these RPGs? Just look for it, because my answer's kind of long.
but probably won't touch this game. Maybe a remaster, but a remake of Chrono Cross seems highly unlikely. Because they know fans are gonna be bitching about the fact that they did Chrono Cross first and not Chrono Trigger. So what's the point, right? You know, it's just not gonna happen. And that's okay, I don't need a remake of this game, I love it. I, I insist, a remaster. Chrono Cross soundtrack is excellent. It's beyond excellence, a masterpiece. You know what? Fuck the treasure chest. Just wanna get the hell out of here. But not before I go back and save the game. <laughs> well, soldiers didn't respawn, did they? Come on, it was, a, it was an interesting grinding session. Okay. All right, guys, let's keep going. Have a lot of people watching, I can't just quit now, huh? Okay. Go away, dude. Stop chasing me. Oh, come on, you motherfucker. <laughs> yes, this might be my longest stream ever. Been playing for two hours and a half. I think I did one with Trails of Cold Steel 3 or another game, probably. That guy, can you believe he evaded all of my attacks? Magma Bomb. Guile, time to put an end to this. Yeah. Final Fantasy VI. I'll make a stream of that game. I have it. The PS1 version, I mean. It's probably gonna be in a couple of weeks. Yeah, it's a fact. I'll stream Final Fantasy VI. Digimon, no. So you do this, and if you fuck it up, you just forget it. It won't open. This door does not have a keyhole. Is this a trick door of some type? There must be a way to open it. You need the code. There's something blocking the way. Yeah, a big monster or a golem or something. <laughs> God damn it. That's all right. You gotta do this on purpose, you know. There's no other way. Yep. And then we beat the crap out of these guys, take their uniforms, and wander around. Can't believe you'll fall for a trap like this. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> you you, you, you dra dragoons are a bunch of dag nuts. 
Dag nut. That's a great insult. I'm gonna start using it. Bring it on, chumps. Now get out. Okay. Same strategy, use the magma bomb to weaken them, then another magma bomb with Keith, and then you beat the crap out of these guys. Guile, your turn. There we go. Dagnut. <laughs> what an interesting insult. You know, Kid, I swear Kid has the best insult. Oh, I didn't get any HP status. That's, that's kind of bad. Now let's change. To the right and to the left. Got that? Better write this down before I forget. You gotta follow Glenn and that's the code for the room upstairs, you know. <laughs> and that's the save point. Seven to the right, two to the left. Ever since that gas from poor Kane, the general has been acting strange. Of course he means licks. He definitely means links. A revive, oh, most useful item in this game. Let's give that to Guile. Yeah, that's okay. All right. But first, we gotta do a few things here. Talk with this guy who's a boss fight and a playable character. Can Chessy and Busy? <laughs> Dragoon's Honor. That's a great accessory, you know, one of the greatest. One of the greatest. Happy New Year, everybody. You won't be able to come back. You'll see what happens here. 
This is Harley. Meet my absolute favorite character ever in a video game. Zete, please shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, which of us do you choose? You only have one chance. The bigger one, of course. Yeah. Always get it right. <laughs> it's just a joke. A joke battle. An arrow saucer, that's what I found. And turn black. You know, so Guile can do more damage. Oh no, so Surgy can do more damage. You turn one enemy's element to black, and then Surgy does a white attack. And gonna hit really hard. Yeah, so you see there's this guy. Blocking. Ka B, do not enter. Please go around. Yeah. And then there's this room where you gotta fight this guy, and I'm too lazy. Just in case, let's just in case let's just save again. Never forget to save, everybody. Rule number one. There we go. You need permission to enter. Now get back to your post. And another one. Yeah, Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Good or bad is beside the point. It has a pretty interesting soundtrack. Now let's choose the small one. There we go. A nice lens. Well, I'm not slacking off. Now you go back, you get trapped, you meet Lu Luca, or what was her name, Lucia? Yes. This is the treasure vault. You must have special permission to enter. <laughs> Say the password. What? You're imposters. <laughs> Let's try the dash and slash. I haven't done that since I started this game. Yeah! Doesn't do much damage, but it does. Hey, that wasn't so bad. No, 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 
away. Wait a moment. Wait a moment. Uh, whatever. Oh, he didn't die? Come on. Jesus, how could I let that happen? Shame on me. Looks like I'm not getting any power-ups this time. Maybe I'm capped? Probably am. It's a trap room anyway. Here's another one. Over a hundred people still watching this stream. Thanks guys, thank you very much. I'm glad you joined. Glad you didn't miss this great stream. It's just the big one now. There we go. No more power-ups. That's a bummer, you know, like, why? I never understood why. The frozen flame ain't here. The bronze sword, but that's not gonna do anything, you know? I don't have any sword users. Yeah. <laughs> like, what's the point? And the hero shield. It can only be equipped by... One part of the three pieces, hero's collection. So I can't equip it? Yeah, I guess I'll need all three. Some small details, I don't exactly remember what the hell, but yeah, here's a trap. I'm gonna, we're gonna meet Lucia. This must be some kind of trap, we should leave it alone. Whatever, just grab it. <laughs> and we got the silver pendant. <laughs> Only Pierre, huh? Had forgotten about that. No wonder I always had him in my inventory whenever I didn't have Pierre. <laughs> it all makes sense now. I see that you are not really dragoons. Actually, we're just, well, no matter, come out. Because she's supposed to be German, I think. She has a German accent. And then we're gonna have to beat this experimental monster here. Oh, ho, ho. who said anything about helping? It's a, it's a mid boss fight. A mid boss. Lucia, you will, you will all be my guinea pigs. Finish them. They don't look like much, but they are tough. Let me tell you. Yeah. 
is still alive. So what's their element? Green, huh? I don't think I have any yellow elements equipped. Come on, Guile. Do your worst. Weed. Okay. That was fucking weird. Awesome, 100 damage and it didn't die. Tough motherfuckers. There we go. Level up. Oh man, Surge is still far behind. That's why you should never let your characters die during a boss fight. Lesson learned. Wonderful. You have exceeded my expectations by defeating my bulbs. Now please leave. <laughs> That's it, huh? <laughs> I gotta release this guy so he becomes a playable character. You recruit Pip on the pirate ship, if I'm not mistaken. Till we meet again, I will pursue my dream. Yeah, let's just go. There's nothing else here, except we need to talk to her again. I must input this battle data for future study. I will let you go now, leave. Oh, Pip, it is an evolving monster. It will change its format as it battles. Do not free it, please. Fuck you, I will free it. Wait, wait. I am extremely interested in all of you. That means you can come back and recruit her. But that's gotta wait until your second visit to the Viper Manor. This is Karsh. <laughs> yeah, what do you want? Never mind. <laughs> Yo, don't open that. Oh yeah, the butt. Come on, what's going on here? Why isn't it opening? Wasn't there like a switch here? What the fuck? Is it glitch? What are you doing return to pose to Gigi? Jess, what is it? Bust it up! Gotta beat this asshole. Oh, he got a turn really quick. Wow, he packs quite a punch. He's yellow color. No, 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 guys. I'm not playing this game until midnight. Just a few more minutes and I'm out of here. I'm so sorry, but you know. It's just not possible. 
Would have been interesting to plan the stream until midnight, you know. To start, I don't know, around 10 p.m. And celebrate the new year playing this game. You know, the moment. But for some of you, it's already January the 1st, so... I guess that's cool, huh? Oh, he's not dead yet, come on! No, no, not until midnight, that's like... <laughs> Midnight is in like four hours, guys. I can't do it. There we go. Finally dead. I'm just gonna go against Lynx and that'll be the end. Yeah, I got some power-ups. Cool. Whoa, awesome. Haha, <laughs> you missed. Wow, he's nailing kid, come on. There we go. No power-ups? Come on! That sucks. I mean, you expect to get power-ups from that guy, you know? There we go. Fucking finally. Seven to the right and two. Turn it. Seven to the right. Three, four, five, six, seven. Two to the left. 
There we go. Love this view. Now there's a boss fight incoming. Meet Marcy. So, like, what are you doing here? <laughs> dragoons aren't allowed up here, you know. We're not really dragoons. <laughs> Some weirdos. Like, can I kill him yet? <laughs> patience, child, patience. I need to have a word with these people. Who are you? And how do you know Serge? How do I explain? I guess you could say I'm a prophet of time. Here comes the story. Another world similar to our own exists in another dimension. That's where Serge comes from. Surge, this world is not the world you grew up in. Ten years ago, something happened that put your very soul teetering on the balance scales of fate. It's a very interesting plot and it's well explained, you know, for it to make some sense. You're still gonna have to fight Mar Marcy. There's no way around that. You have no place in this world. Here you are but a ghost brought back from the past. <laughs> he created sort of like a butterfly effect and altered the course of history. Surge is the Chrono Trigger. I mean it. You are the missing piece from a giant puzzle. That's just genius writing, you know, all thanks to Masato Kato. Credit goes to the greatest scriptwriter of RPGs. For your information, if you press the start button while on the world map, a menu window will appear that allows you to display which world you are in. Your home world or another world. <laughs> then why the bloody hell did Search die? Interesting question, right? You can only find out by moving on. No way I'm gonna let you, because she's one of the three generals in this army. I guess it cannot be helped. This may be fate in itself. <laughs> we ain't here to play Jax. And she's a very dangerous enemy. One of the four devas, the highest rank of the Akasha Dragoons. Yeah, the generals. <laughs> And 
And there's yet another boss fight after this against Harley. Wow, a critical attack. Okay, you wouldn't wanna, you wouldn't wanna use the blue elements. We want the red elements, cause she's blue. Fifty-two. Come on, kid. Take this. Oh, she just slapped me. <laughs> Gotta make a field turn red, so we can cause more damage. Sixty-one. Not bad. Whoa. All right. Nice. <laughs> oh no, I don't have any more red elements. Gotta be up to Kith. This is gonna hurt. Haha. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any more red ones. So let's just go with dash and slash. That should be it, right? I think you're so smart. And how about this? She's gonna attack all my party members. She had to get away with that, didn't she? Damn you, Marcy. Why you? No! Fucking bitch! That's it. That was Marcy. Pretty interesting character. A lowly that's really powerful. What a surprise, huh? And I got a nice blast from her. Pretty cool. Hmm. It's not over yet. And I'll get you next time. Sure. Get me next time. Very well, I shall advise, your, uh, advise you on, of your next step. There are eight pillars standing in the main hall. Behind the second to last pillar on the left is a button to release a platform. Beware, however, there is a much stronger being you will encounter. That is true. Damn, Guile, he only has like four spaces. This is why Guile, in, in some sense, kind of sucks. But okay, that's okay. Oh, here comes Harley, that's right.
Okay, let's go with um, Cure. Photon Ray is gonna be like really high. And then how about the Ice Blast? Oh, I'll give that to Guile. Sounds legit. <laughs> Looks legit. Yeah, you can't save. Before Harley, my favorite character. You are even more sexy than I zogged. Ooh la la. <laughs> Who the bloody hell are you? This vulgar one must be kidding. You disgust moi. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> Harley Quinn. you can do much better if you gave her up you should not defy him oi what's your problem please munzage you shut up i'm having a serious conversation with Sergi. Why don't you mind your own business? <laughs> Put up your dukes. I'm gonna kick your ass so hard you'll kiss the moons. <laughs> I want a t-shirt with kids saying that. But alas, I cannot be caught fighting you here. Imagine the trouble I will get into. Au revoir, mon zudge. See you again. I told you guys, you don't fight Harley at this point. You do fight her, but later in the game. So the second pillar. And this guy's gonna run against me. What do you think you're doing? And then there's a save point coming up before Lynx. Man, some people can be very, be very noisy. 
my roommates upstairs are doing quite a racket. All right, let's go. And here is the save point. If you fight one of those doors with the eyes, you get a scene with Riddell. And I think there's a treasure chest. Oh, guys, I'm exhausted. I've been here for three hours. I wanted to make it to Lynx, but the, you know, all the Lynx events is gonna be a lot of dialogue, the boss fight, which is really hard. And then more talking, time to make a decision. It's gonna be like half an hour. I don't know if I can make it. Three hours, guys, that's a lot. I'm tired and hungry. <sighs> Fuck it, let's do it. Oh, this isn't the place, that's right. <laughs> it's this one right here. You gotta fight the eye.
Finally. Can I get some power-ups after this, please? No? Oh, yeah. Just a little bit, though. It wasn't much, but whatever. Better than nothing. Oh! And there it is, Lynx, the main antagonist in this game. The Radical Dreamers! Here comes the boss fight.
Well, he's just debuffing me all over again. I mean, over and over again. Oh, there we go. Finally got this back, my white element. It's not that hard of a fight, but it can be dangerous, you know. Oh, come on, Lynx. Almost there. Come on, Surge. It's an instant death skill. Motherfucker, I hope he misses. Yeah. Wow. Was worried for the second. Come on. It's not gonna do much damage, but it'll do the trick. Wait, Gaia doesn't have anything else except Revive. Hellbound. That sucks. No, please miss. Please miss. God fucking damn it. Get a free shot at her panties. Magma Bomb's gonna have to do it. Perhaps I should have healed Kid. Jesus Christ, die, man. Gravitone that hits all characters. Usually. Whoa. Yeah. Heal my man, Surge. My boy. So we're gonna wish everybody a happy new year before I leave. That was the boss fight. After the scene, I'm gone, guys. It was just a shadow, right. Although it did feel like the true Lynx. Did you think I would be stupid enough to pick a fight with a rabid dog? <laughs> God damn you, Lynx. What do you desire from this world? Do you wish to live again? Do you wish to erase your demise from the pages of history? What's wrong, Sergi? A cutscene. That's Chronopolis.
Bugger, this doesn't look good. You cannot escape. Daddy, about the voyage, oh? Don't move a whisker if you want this girl to live. Huh. Redelta party member two, she joins late in the game. Pretty much almost every character in this game. Most of the people who are, who have a portrait. Your right, search? Come on, let's bust out of here. And Guile, I love how he just stays there, you know. He didn't grab the item he was looking for. You completely, completely ignore Guile's quest in this game. Huh. Pierre is probably the worst. You fiend, take your dirty hands off Larry Riddell. You see, Cars is in love with Riddell. Come on, Guile. Huh. And come on, game. Hurry up. This is the Colonel Trigger scene. This changes kids' fate drastically. What do you live for? What are you willing to die for? I've been waiting for you, Serge. Waiting a long, long time for you. Come to me, sir, the assassin of time. The Chrono Trigger. I told you guys, Surge was the Chrono Trigger. And he's not even in that game. Yeah. One hundred viewers. Thanks for watching, everybody. Chrono Cross, my favorite RPG of all time, a masterpiece, fantastic game. It was great. It was great to spend all this time with you. It was a great year with all of you guys. Whether you started watching my videos a couple of days, weeks, months, or years ago. Thank you very much for your support. Happy New Year. Cheers to a, a new year, a 2020 full of great videos and more of this kick-ass community we have all built and maintained. Thank you very much, guys. I'll see you next year, I guess. <laughs> see you in 2020. Thank you very much. See you next time.